Alrighty, boys and girls, welcome back to walkthrough part three. Now, we've just made it into the courtyard of the library where we've been following the time trolls left behind by one of the guys that abducted my younger brother. So we've got to go and save him and um, we've got to figure out a way into the exit which is up there and I'm just going to press the Y button so you can see that's where we got to head to. We've amalgamated a nice range of time bending and time stopping uh, powers since we got affected in the blast inside Paul's uh, lab in part one of my walkthrough. So yeah here we are guys and this uh, I've got to mention this this is running on Xbox One X and it's looking gorgeous guys. It, I think it has a temporal uh, resolution of 1440p which is about four times that of the standard Xbox One so as you can see the textures have been improved and it's looking that bit nicer guys it would have been nice if in the next patch uh, the developers somehow work out a 1080 60 performance mode as seen in games such as Gears of War 4 and Rise of the Tomb Raider alright guys so let's get up there and please drop a big like in the comments and tell me which part you enjoyed most. Also, let me know, are you guys hyped as I am about the One X? What are your thoughts uh, and your perspective on this new all-powerful, all-seeing and all-dancing console from Microsoft? Do you see them uh, getting back the lead from Sony or do you think Sony are too far ahead from them? Uh, ahead of them to stand a chance let me know in the comments and as always guys please follow us on twitch and also subscribe to our main channel awesome bob gaming and thanks for watching guys right so let's yeah here we go right we stop time nailed it <clears throat> all right let's climb up And let's press Y. Here we go, guys. We found an open window. Right, let's get in there. This is Airlift Prime. We've got the time machine core in transit. Oh wow. Okay. Hey, hands where I can see. Oh, snaps. Sucks to be you. Ho ho ho. He took it in the head. What the hell is going on around here? All right. I think that's probably the other uh, female agent helping me. And I'm revisiting this game again. I loved it the first time round, but obviously back then I didn't have the facility to uh, stream to my Twitch. And guys, please let me know, is there a way that I can stream at 60 FPS using my Xbox One uh, X without buying like external hardware like the Elgato capture card? I'd love for my streams to be 60 FPS because, you know, having this all new powerful console, it would be nice to allow my streams to be at 60 FPS as well. Please let me know if you said a video and um, you know, I'm, d I'm currently doing some research myself, obviously, but uh, if someone could give me the lowdown in the comments and save me the time and bother, I'd really, really appreciate it. And thank you in advance, guys. God bless. Oh, I love the line in this game. Oh, and the game that these company also did the amazing Alan Wake. And as you can see, Alan Wake was a game that had superb lighting effects. It really looked really advanced on the old 360 and this game uh, follows in that tradition guys it really is a superb looking game so we play the protagonist jack joyce in an in our endeavors to rescue our brother and find out what the about and obviously stop time from imploding on itself hq we've got william joyce in the library all right so william joyce is my brother guys so that's where we're going to rescue <laughs> Oh, seriously? <laughs> well, that was unexpected, but guess what? I have the ability to regen. All right, guys, that's not, um, that was a little bit of a mishap. I hate this lengthy loading in between screens. All right, let's do it. Let's do this again, guys. And this time, let's try not to get yourself killed, Jack. Seriously. HQ, we've got William Joyce in the live order. Oh, 
Oh, damn. Alright, here we go. Damn it. Five minutes? We better get our brother the hell out of there then. Obviously, this fires less bullets, but obviously it's more powerful. Just hit my little brother, right? You, you're gonna die. Press B to create time shield. Here we go, guys. Ha <laughs> ha, suckers. Yeah, that's for pistol whipping me. You're foul. You're Will, full. You all right? All right. Define all right. You're fine. All right, so we we've... Uh, Where's my car? I didn't like the color. Let's get a new one. What? <laughs> no, Jack. I need them. Oh. Hold that thought. <laughs> My briefcase was in that car. I'll take you shopping. It's a fucking briefcase. A briefcase that contains something I need in order to stop the fracture. And you didn't think to spell that out to me before. It's true. Drive me down, over. Yeah, well, it's not too late to leave you here. Staying alive. That's part of the messed up shit I need to explain. You got any theories about being able to manipulate time? Time's come up with one. Shit! Huh? Huh? He's right here! Shit! Oh shit. Gotta be careful guys. Alright, cool. Changing out! Providing Watch him out! Yeah, punk ass. Get a fudge out of here. You 
damn right I'm taking the SMG. SMG's mine! Right, that's them taken care of. Oh yeah. Oh, you want me to help you up again? Seriously? Yeah. All right. I think so. All right, people. See what I'm saying? The game's the game is cool. Why? Who is she? She knows about the fracture. I trust her. Glad you trusted somebody. It's not that simple, Jack. They kept secrets from you to keep you safe. Safe? Look around you, Will. Does this feel safe to you? This isn't my fault. Beth warned me this would happen. I did everything in my power to stop it. But you never told me any of this. Just if you know. We don't have time for this. Game looks project. gorgeous on the One X, guys. I can't stress enough how lovely this game looks. Let me just look at it. It's not half bad, is it? So far, it's it's nice having all that extra power. And I had a lot of great games on the One S anyway. And the backwards compatibility. And also, the Xbox 360 backwards compatibility is just the icing on the cake. To me, it's just like having the Xbox equivalent of a PS4 Pro, guys. And I just hope that developers start bringing out patches that push the hardware properly. And don't bring out shovelware like they've been doing with many of the uh, uh, PS4 Pro games i personally don't mind games running at 1440p guys seriously i'd rather have 1440p at stable 60 fps than 4k um at 30 or or you know that's that's just my preference not to say that i will say no to 4k because uh gears of war just look good i have to say and so does tomb raider let's move before more of them show up Jack! What the fudge? So why are you with the enemy then? Huh? What the hell's Jack, going on, guys? Hold on. I'm sorry, Jack. Whoa! Damn! So he's got superpowers as well. He just went flippin' oh, dead at, uh, what'd you call what it? You doing? Only what's he went flash on me. Think about this, you don't know what's at stake. I know exactly what's at stake, that's why I'm here. You believe you can stop what's coming? I'm giving you one chance to change your mind. This p it's already said it can't be changed. The past, the future, uh, uh, I've seen it. I've lived it. For 17 years. 17 years. It was you, the first experiment. Come with me and we can see this through. Or hold on to your hope and burn with it. Now listen, I built a device. I can stop this. I can. You can't. This is madness. There's no harm in trying. There is. That's why I can't risk you opposing me, Will. It doesn't have to end like this. We can't just let this happen. I'll never stop trying. It took me years to come to terms with what must be done. But we don't have years. Wait, wait, wait. <sighs> Trigger. I never wanted this. Alright guys, I am royally pissed. My brother just got crushed under some rubble. My so-called friend, it's just turned out that he's the uh, bad guy in all of this. And that was the act of, end of Act 1. And it's all coming together. And <laughs> boy, that was a surprise when he went flipping. You know, when he beat down my ass and told me uh, what was going on. So far, 
I have to say, Act 1 has had a nice little build up to it, and I personally like this, although there have been people criticising it, saying that they didn't enjoy the gameplay or the, this and that, but you know what guys, all said and done, it's not a bad little game, personally, in my opinion. And obviously, it looks nicer on the uh, um, Xbox One X, but I would have loved to have had a performance mode where they hit the 60 FPS. 30 frames is sufficient, but hell, wouldn't this have this run nicer at 60? I founded Monarch Solutions 17 years ago with a very clear purpose. There are those who would question my actions. <laughs> All right, guys, this is the other agent guy now. This is a final statement of vindication, a testimony. These two agents are basically helping me. To be. I've always been devoted to my mission. Never deterred from my goal, no matter the sacrifice. Because I've seen where this leads. I've seen where it all ends. We have a problem. No word from Jack Joyce's transport. It should have arrived here by now. We may have a traitor on the inside. You're due for your treatment. I'll find who's behind this. Find Jack. That's our priority. Get your best man on it. There's more. As you know, Jack's level of interference led to unexpected complications. Witnesses from the university were transported here. You need to take a look. We can't afford any further obstacles at this stage of the plan. Now, I see two options. We could use force, remove any loose ends. But if those witnesses disappear, the public will start asking questions, potentially turn on Monarch. Alternatively, I could mount a broad PR strategy, get the city on our side. All clear, sir. But that leaves us with the, the loose ends. Precisely. It's yours, but keep in mind. The men will view your decision as a unified strategy moving forward. Mr. Serene? I suggest we deal with the issue at hand. Liam Burke over there can explain the situation in more detail. Of course. How long until the core is ready for transport? It'll be en route to Monarch headquarters in less than an hour. Installation should be complete before the gala. Good. Paul, the men are waiting for your input. It was the first time I'd visited the Ground Zero operation in ages. The location I'd arrived in when I went 17 years back in time. The location where my fate was sealed six years ago. Jack would never understand the necessity of what I'd done. It was the death William deserved, but his knowledge posed too great a risk to our plan. I want this delivered to my office. What is it? A reminder. Library? Serene brought down the whole building just to take out that. Sir, who is this? Amy Ferrero. She's one of the witnesses. The way she on how to proceed. decision on how to proceed with the witnesses.
My powers grew stronger, even as the Cronon Syndrome worsened. I could choose a path that would become the actual future, but it wasn't optional. The moment wouldn't end until I made up my mind. Potential threats to our plan need to be erased. Wait! Monarch would take a hardline approach. Crush all obstacles, eliminate all witnesses. It would be harsh. But I had made hard choices for the greater good before. I dug through the area and I found everything I could on your bro. This is messed up, man. Trusted monarch. But the people of Riverport would turn against. Our secrets would be safe, but the public would hate us, and Jack would gain new allies. Monarch's got no authority to stop you, and you tell that to everybody on that bridge. Initialize a PR campaign. I want to sting you. And that violence was because of Jack Joyce. Monarch would take a PR-friendly approach and manipulate the public into siding with us. Our lies would give us control. The manhunt continues as authorities search for Jack Joyce. Hey, somebody sneak around down there. All right, guys, if we take the PR approach, we basically uh, use the media spread lies. But we don't kill Jack. the witness. If we take the hardline approach, we basically murder this lady, and that, that's all she wrote for her. And Jack would learn our secrets. Let's take the PR approach. Just, just. I want to stay. And that violence was because. All right. Oh, okay. Sorry, guys. I pressed the B button, thinking that I could go back and then choose that option. Beg your pardon. Yeah. Sorry about that. Hello, viewers. But please continue to follow me on Twitch, guys. I really, really can't stress enough how much I need more followers, guys. I need tons and tons more, and also I need loads more uh, subs on my YouTube channel. I'm trying to break a thousand subs, so that I can therefore start getting live. Um, sponsors that will in help and then uh, help me aid in raising money to save the life of a four-year-old who needs emergency surgery. So please help, guys. Subscribe now, Awesome Bob Gaming, and thanks for watching. All right, we've gone for the PR approach. We can't risk any unwanted attention. Convince the witnesses not to talk. Keep eyes on them and send them home. Initialize a PR campaign. We need the city on our side. Smart choice, mate. It's always better to get the people behind you. Not this one. She's the head of the anti-monarch movement. I think we're looking at the new face of our campaign. Jack! There's no other way out. I'm going through the machine. Oh, wait. No! Jack! This way! All right, this all happened previously when we were inside the lab, and now we get to see what happened to this guy. Whoa. I use my power to guide us. To decide how to best prepare for the inevitable end of time. That gives the chosen few a chance to survive. I've seen end of time. <laughs> okay. <sighs> 
Right, Junction 1 PR, you chose to save Serene. You chose to have Serene take the PR approach. Friends, 40%. Right, so one of my friends agreed with my choice, and the community of the community agreed with your choice. Okay. Let's continue, guys. This is Quantum Break, guys. Episode 1, Monarch Solutions. All right. It's not a bad little game. It's by the creators of Alan Wake. Oh, we've got some live video bits. Okay. He's kind of lucky they let her live. The middle, I assume that's your mother. On the left, of course, your father. And on the right, the little one. How old is she? Right, so they're using bully blackmail tactics to get her to do what, what they're bidding. And I mean, seriously, anyone in that situation when they had their family threatened would do the same. Is that correct? <laughs> you know what I'm saying, guys? That was taken not five minutes ago by my associate, Michael. What do you want? I want a statement. And you don't want Michael outside of your house a moment longer. What happens to me? Well, that's entirely up to you. Do it. Good choice. I'm so glad we could work this out. We just threatened her family, mate. And you would have ended up killing her if she said no. So <laughs> what choice did she really have? You know what I'm saying? Alrighty, so we've been blackmailed, basically. This guy's so shifty and shady looking. Liam. Walk with me. Seems your work's been undone. We just lost communication with Jack Joyce's transport. How the fuck does that happen? Knowing how isn't important, you just need to find him. Wincott is working on a location. Great. What is it? What? Something's wrong. University. That's not how we operate. It was sloppy. Have all your operations gone smoothly? Go home, Liam. Wait for the call. Yes, go home to your wife. I'm Make sure a love. And get some pur. Oh, and talk of his wife. <laughs> She's calling him. Alright guys, I'm gonna leave this, I'm not gonna let it play out just a bit longer. Stan makes it easy. See, the guy goes around using the same username and password everywhere he goes. Now, <laughs> that means that his cloud isn't so protected. May I present to you, Exhibit A. <laughs> wow, God, oh. seriously? <laughs> did that, did well, you yeah. just see what I just saw? Look, like some guy was tied up doing some bondage with oh, uh, no, gags or some shit going on there. Crazy, crazy. You know what this is? Do they have these in Idaho? I will. Whatever. Use it. You tell me what's next, Brenner? I don't know. I know you don't know. 
that makes me sad for you. All we do now is upload our girl's video to Stan and our friends at WZWY send Stan a note with some of his private and, but not least, the letter. That letter allows Reclaim to take full responsibility for everything that's happening. Signed sincerely, your local terrorist, Jack Joyce. Who's <laughs> sadly been framed for committing acts that he <laughs> never did. <laughs> Oh, it's the big boss. Mr. Hatch, perfect timing. Me and Brenner, we just dug up some major dirt on uh, <laughs> on our news director over at WZWY. He'll be uh, he'll be running our copy and posting that girl's video within an hour. Good work, Woodcock. Where are we with Joyce? Joyce? Uh, well, I I got a lock on his transpo. I'm mean, I packed into his camera. I'm I'm waiting to find a locale. It's not it's not it's not incredibly easy. Keep an eye on it, and when you find him, contact Burke directly. I think we have a traitor in our midst. Wow, this guy sounds like um, Sinclair out of um, Killzone Shadowfall and also the voice of Commander Zavala. Um, uh, what's it called? Uh, Destiny guys, the, the black gentleman, you know, the bald headed guy. I thought I recognized that voice. Let me know in the comments if you agree. He sounds like Zavala, Zavala out of Destiny. All right, so this guy's got some surveillance shit going on. If you're enjoying the stream and, and uh, liking the channel, please tell your friends on Twitch as well to come and check us out. We really appreciate the followers and also really, really appreciate those of you that sub and uh, follow us and support us on at Awesome Bob Gaming on our YouTube channel. Oh, hello. So he's getting ready to get some honey. Some honey. Things have been really bad at Damn, man, his wife, he ain't too bad. He should spend more time at home. <laughs> Seriously. I dreamt you were a cat. A cat? Mm -hmm. <laughs> All these big furry bear paws. Way too big for your body. That is a strange creature. But I knew it was you. I have to get back to work soon. This was a, the live action movie part of the show that was basically filmed as part of the game. Baby, you haven't been home in two days. Your mom's being difficult. Oh, I'm, I'm, she is. I'm being, being difficult, huh? She's being very difficult. <laughs> oh, I was wondering who he's talking to for a moment, but obviously he's <laughs> she's pregnant with his kid. <laughs> <so>. the, the <laughs> baby. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Okay. You win. <laughs> Close your eyes. No peeking. Isn't that always the way? Just as they're about to get it on, his phone is ringing. Zzz, it's okay. Yeah. Burke, you got a lead on Joyce. What is it? I was able to track his transpo to a warehouse on Burgundy and Wilkins. It's inside Ground Zero Perimeter. Sending you the coordinates now. All right, so they've located Jack. <laughs> oh yeah, wearing he's probably wearing his boxer shorts as well. So, 
Oh well, she didn't get the deal and he didn't give her the purr. Or rather, she didn't give him the purr and he didn't give her the deal. Oh well, mate. Tough choice to make. Oh, look. In order to rebuild this great city, transforming it. Yeah, let's skip that. All right, end of episode one, guys. Let's talk about the dry dock incident. Monarch operatives transported you from the university <clears throat> to the ground zero operation at the shipyard. Still upset about that, huh? You were secured, unconscious. Well, uh, what the Liam fudge? Went to okay. You, and you were gone. How? Sleepwalking. Step away right now. You have three seconds till I pull. I had better reflexes. And you're a marksman. <laughs> <clears throat> Who stopped time now? I'm, I'm always wondering who's manipulating. Is it this guy's doing it, or someone, some external source? Oh wow, there was a. Okay, things are getting interesting. Yeah. Okay, I'll take that. Thank you very much. We know Beth Wilder assisted you in some manner. Then I guess <laughs> we know the rest. No, because everybody who saw what you did next is now dead. <laughs> He's taking the guns off both of them. Oh, what a joker. Alrighty. I didn't have a clue where I was. Why? Never questioned it because it didn't feel real. Still waiting to wake up. Alrighty, ladies and gents. I'm going to start part three there. Tune in uh, in two minutes to see part four it's getting interesting i've basically left those two there taking their guns so when they come to when they unfreeze they're gonna be wondering what the hell happened to them this is getting rather interesting it's not a bad little game guys i'm um getting i'm revisiting this on my one x and have to say uh there are benefits of this running on more powerful hardware for, for starters we're getting a uh, four times increase in resolution over the xbox one which is pretty pretty awesome and uh yeah the texture filtering and textures overall are looking nicer but i hope in a future update the developers bring us a 1080 60 mode you know performance mode because i you know i think the game will run overall would run nicer running at 60 fps it's running at a what looks to me like a rock solid 30 so it's looking nice running nice can't really fault it let me know in the comments what you think and so far let me know please which part was your favorite and see you in part four guys and i hope you're all having a wonderful weekend dragoness join me in part four sweetheart which will be in one minute just gonna go rest my eyes quickly grab a drink and i'll be back so see you in about two minutes rough give me two minutes see you all remember to smash that like and follow us on twitch and subscribe to awesome bob gaming and you for now